All right, so if you want to set me up with your girl's friend, I'm listening, pitch me on it. Um, she's funny. Yeah, I'm Thank you, next topic. What, what's wrong with being funny? There's nothing wrong with being funny, but funniness is a secondary characteristic, not a primary one. What? Okay, if you said she was hot and then also funny, great, but no man with honest intentions is describing a woman as funny and also hot. Hotness would be up front and center, unless of course you were struggling for selling points. Why do you have a graph? Normally, if you were trying to sell a guy on a woman, you would mention her looks first, then assure me she's not crazy or been smashed by everyone, then you might discuss how funny she is as a bonus, but for God's sakes, not the main course. Uh, I don't know, man. My girl says she's really funny. Well, now we're in an even worse position because coming from a female friend, a funniness cosign means very little. These women are more than happy to let their friend inaccurately be described as funny as long as they still see themselves above that friend in a trait they value higher. For example, looks or achieving life goals. In that case, these women will throw funniness claims around like participation trophies. What is happening right now? What is this? By the way, even when they're not doing that, girls will be inclined to call their female friend funny simply because she considers herself to be funny and engages in the act of trying to be funny the most, which her friends will now hastily label as funny. The same way that if a guy described himself as fashionable and always had new outfits and hats, you might just pass along that fashionable claim without even thinking about verifying. I don't know. Which I again, just... is not the end of the world to have a self-described funniness diagnosis if it wasn't paired with the absence of a primary characteristic. But since she's not even hot enough for you to mention in your original description, there's a decent chance this funny you mentioned could just manifest as annoying. I mean, I told her you're funny. funny can be used as a primary characteristic to describe a man if it's coming from another man. Whereas a woman-to-woman -woman funniness diagnosis can be solely based on attempts, males generally need to see that funny plane landed. So the cosine generally represents a consensus of the male peers who also have respect for the value of their funny cosine, like in the case of you describing me. Well, what if it wasn't me that said you were funny? What if it was my girl that said you were funny? Does that change anything? Obviously it does. Then we're back to funny being a supplementary characteristic, as long as the gender of both parties is the same. If the description of me to this allegedly funny woman was coming from a woman, there would also need to be a primary characteristic it's paired with. For example, good job and funny is in good shape and funny. Once again, funniness is a characteristic that raises the value of the primary positive trait. All right, well, if you're done with whatever this is, she's also pretty hot. And there it is. So even after I badgered you that hard about the look, surely you would have thought to yourself you need to put some juice on that description. And even with that added juice, all I get is pretty hot. So who the fuck knows what that means? She has a good personality, great personality. Good personality. I don't even know where to begin with that one. And I think for the both of us, it would be better if you just left. This is my house. Now, please. Well, someone's got to date her because she hangs out here all the time and she's very annoying.